Stefan, there is no quiet day in Tour de Suisse. Today again was quite nervous. Yeah, yeah, it was. Uh, I mean, it's interesting finales actually. It's uh, or I like it more than just a uh, pure sprints. So today was also like a little mini classic stage, and uh, that that made the race interesting. Uh, Peter Sagan tried uh, on the last climb, but everybody was ready, and uh, then he came to a group like yesterday to a small bunch sprint. How is this experience to have the Yellow Jersey here in your country? Yeah, really nice. I mean, it's, uh, it's really the race I've been following since I'm a little kid on the side of the road, road in the beginning. And then uh, last year I experienced the first time as, as a professional. So wearing the yellow jersey at home, it's, uh, it really makes me proud. And uh, yeah, I'm getting used to it. It's a pleasure. Tomorrow, what do you expect? It's different. It's a longer climb. Yeah, it's, uh, what I can say is I'm feeling good so far. So uh, yeah, I'm pretty confident uh, heading in to tomorrow's stage we'll see how it goes what the GC guys have in mind if they I mean if they really go for it then it's going to be difficult but uh, yeah we'll see and uh, the goal is to defend the jersey. But it's not what you expect the GC guys attacked or already it could be a good opportunity for them? Uh, tomorrow they announce a lot of rain so then it's always a different story but uh, yeah it's, it's hard to tell at, at the moment I think nobody really knows what it's going to happen until we're there and then we'll see. <laughs> If the GC guys attack, you will defend your jersey or you will more help uh, Richie Paul? I think uh, one that these two things go well together also today. I was up there together with Richie and uh, so, yeah, I mean, once you're up there, then, then we'll see. I mean, if if I really have to have to go for it to, to maybe save the situation for Richie, then I'm sure I will do because he's our, he's our long term objective is to win the Tour de Suisse and I think he for sure has the best uh, best opportunities in the team, the best qualities to do so. So uh, I mean when it really comes down man to man then for sure I will be in, uh, in Richie's support. In stage five, do you think that's going to be the deciding one for you in terms of if you can be a GC hit, rider hit? <laughs> yeah, I think uh, it's, it's going to be difficult to really look for like long-term GC because that was not the goal coming into this Tour de Suisse. I mean, when you look at the profiles, the climbs, they don't seem so steep. But I mean, when you see Richie climbing at the moment, I think uh, it's going to be difficult for anyone to follow him. But you've got the, the final time trial as well. Look. The time trial is on the race. Yeah, but uh, the climb to Arosa, uh, I think it's on Friday. That's uh, it's quite a tough one. I've done it already, in a, like in a hill hill climb race as an amateur. So I know this climb, and uh, for sure there, at least there, for sure I'm gonna lose time. So I'm not looking that. I'm looking forward to that. I'm just looking day for day and see how it goes.